there has been a request for the recipe for birth stroganoff and apparently that's what we are having for lunch today. Also, I've decided to teach you a German word or expression at the end of each of my videos, so stay tuned. is not a German recipe, it's actually Russian, but it has been integrated into the German kitchen for a very long time. Need good beef for this recipe, if possible use some filet or steak from the hip. When I went to a local grocery last night, I didn't get either. Actually all the filets that were there were wrapped in bacon, I will not comment on that. You will find the complete list of ingredients and amounts on my blog My German Recipe. At the beginning you dab the meat dry with a paper towel or so, if not already done by your butcher, cut it in stripes and set aside. I have already prepared the onions just to spare you my tears and the mushroom thankfully came like that. For the pickles you can use just any. I happen to have cornicons, how do you pronounce that? And we'll use these and I've already cut them into slices. I start with heating some oil in the frying pan and once it's hot enough I add half of the meat and fry it from all sides. I then take it out and set it aside. And do the same with the other half of the meat. Add the onions, pickles and mushrooms to the frying pan and fry them.
add this all to the bowl with the meat. And next I pour beef broth to the pan and let it boil for a little bit on high temperature. One tablespoon of mustard. I'm using a German brand, but American will do too. Two tablespoons of still cream. Now the meat and everything else goes back into the sauce to get warm again. Don't let it boil or simmer, just stay below that. and pepper for the taste. And that's it. We serve the stroganoff with potatoes. You will notice that potatoes are irregular on our plates. So and now we'll teach you a German expression that we use before we eat. Guten Appetit. It means that we wish everyone in our company a good appetite and we say that when everyone sits at the table and the plates are filled with food. Nobody starts eating before we wish each other Guten Appetit. So I hope you like this video. If so, please give it a thumbs up and Guten Appetit.